Welcome graduates, welcome family and friends. It's my pleasure to welcome all of you to our virtual commencement ceremony. During this ceremony, we will be recognizing students who have completed the graduation requirements between December of 2019 and the summer of 2020. I want to start by recognizing the members of our Board of Trustees. These individuals volunteer their time throughout the year to provide guidance and direction for the college. Typically, they're seated on the stage during a commencement ceremony. But as you all know, this is not a typical year. And so due to requirements for social distancing, they, like all of you, are watching from home. This has been an interesting year for all of us. And college personnel and students alike have had to adapt. The COVID-19 pandemic has created a number of challenges not the least of which has been the fact that we've been unable to be together for face-to-face -face classes since mid-March. It's been incredibly quiet on campus, not at all typical of a college campus in the spring. We have missed seeing all of our students. But I must say that the manner in which everyone has responded to this unprecedented circumstance has been commendable. There have been many positive reports about how the transition to online coursework went and how students have responded. We certainly would prefer to have been able to continue to interact on campus. But as you will see in the video presented a little later in this ceremony, faculty, staff, and students were all very flexible and adaptable and were able to maintain many of the activities that we had planned for the spring semester. Activities like poster day and pay it forward week, and of course, commencement. It's been a memorable year to say the least. Life takes unpredictable twists and turns. Many of you have experienced that throughout your lives, but it's certainly been very apparent this year. As we began the academic year in August, we were not anticipating a global pandemic that would impact our lives in such dramatic ways. The abrupt ending to our face-to-face -to -face time together on campus was unexpected to say the least. But while it separated us in terms of physical distance, it has in some ways made our connection to each other even greater. This is a year that will stand out in history and it will be talked about many years into the future. And we will all be bonded together through our shared experience of this situation. Life is filled with defining moments. How you respond to challenges throughout your life says a lot about who you are. And all of our students and graduates had an opportunity this spring to demonstrate who you are. And your ability to keep going and complete your courses and complete your graduation requirements in light of the significant challenges presented by COVID-19 says a lot about you. And it says a lot about your potential for success in dealing with challenges in the future. Success in life isn't about how you operate in a perfect world, as if there were such a thing. It's about responding appropriately and effectively when life isn't perfect. It's about continuing to move forward when obstacles present themselves. I am very proud of each one of the graduates being recognized in this ceremony. You have been persistent, you have been resilient, and you have accomplished a major milestone. I hope that you will take pride in this accomplishment. I know that everyone at Southwestern Community College is very, very proud of you. I hope you enjoy our virtual commencement ceremony.
wonderful looking back on the year and remembering all the positives that happen and the energy and excitement that can be felt on our campus. Thank you to all of the students, faculty, and staff for making the SWIT community so special. One of our students that helps make our community so special is our next speaker, Sarah Kernan. Sarah is from Bedford and a graduate of the Mount Air Community School. Sarah was a vice president of her LPN program and is currently the vice president of the RN program. She is also a member of Phi Theta Kappa. Ladies and gentlemen, Sarah Kernan. Good evening, SWIC administration and faculty, family, friends, and fellow 2020 graduates. Today marks a major milestone for us, one we were all unsure we were going to make. March 13th, as we left for spring break, we were notified we would not be returning to campus until April 3rd, and all of our classes would now be online. Now, I know quite a few of us had a mini celebration. I know I did, because it cut back on my commute just a little bit longer. Well, I don't have to tell you how it turned out since I'm presenting to you from my home. The good news is, even though it's not even close to how we imagined it would be, but that we're here. When Kate asked me about speaking at this year's ceremony, my first reaction was, why me? I was going to decline. You see, I'm not a public speaker, but I promised her I would think about it, and here I am. I officially started classes at SWIC the spring of 2018 and would enter the nursing program that fall. One single life event changed my path. I lost my job. Never would I have thought that at this stage of my life, I would be going back to school. However, here was the opportunity and all I had to do was jump. With the amazing support of my family, I began my journey as a full-time student. If I had said any part of it was easy, I'd be lying. It's anything but. I know I speak for many of the nursing graduates when I say many tears were shed over the last two years. It's been a difficult journey as we've become part of each other's lives. I've made many new friends these last three years at SWIC, most of them around the age of my oldest children. Because of this, I became mom under two conditions. Don't ask me for money and don't expect presents at holidays and birthdays. I can truly say I love my SWIC kids. Not long before we left for spring break, one of my class children said, I can't believe we're almost done. What are we going to do when we don't get to see each other every day anymore? When her eyes welled up with tears, that's when I realized how much we really were a family. Our classmates have seen the best of us and they've seen the worst of us and they were still there supporting and understanding because in our case, who better to support a nursing student than another potentially unstable nursing student? Little did we know when we left that Friday, we would not be back to campus and our time that we had expected to spend together would be cut drastically short because of COVID-19. The athletes would be separated from their teammates and the very thing that brought them to SWIC in the first place. Clubs that met regularly like art, drama, and welding, to name a few, now had to adjust to their new socially distanced way of life. Plays were canceled, athletics were stopped, and study groups and tutoring, along with classes, were now online through Canvas or Zoom. COVID-19, the pandemic that changed the way we live. In a matter of weeks, COVID-19 swept across the world, closing stores and creating shortages absolutely disrupting every aspect of our lives. As we continued our studies at home, the date to return to school continued to be pushed back. Panic began setting in for us students at SWIC. CTE students wondering, how will they learn the skills with no hands-on experience? How will I get credits if I'm not in the lab? Are we even going to be able to graduate at all? So much uncertainty about our situation and so many questions. I want to applaud every single member of the SWIC faculty and staff, and personally, the nursing faculty, for the work and effort they put into our education during this time. 
thank you all. Well, here we are, fellow classmates. We've made it. Chances are every single one of us at one point or another never thought this moment would come. And each of us has a story that paved our way here. Always be proud of that story. That's what got you here. We all come from different backgrounds, but we all came to SWIC with the same goal in mind. And as you celebrate victory of your success, remember to thank those who helped you along the way and supported you. I will close with a quote from Henry David Thoreau. If one advances confidently in the direction of his dreams and endeavors to live life which he has imagined, he will meet with success unexpected in common hours. Congratulations, everyone. Thank you. Thank you, Sarah, for sharing your story and for your thoughtful and inspiring message. Dr. Crittenton, the faculty and student services staff certify that these candidates will satisfy the requirements for the degrees and the diplomas they are about to receive. Therefore, it is my pleasure to present the Southwestern Community College Class of 2020. Thank you, Kim. Shortly, we will be presenting the graduates. When the graduates are announced and their photo is shown, you will notice that students who are members of Phi Theta Kappa, which is the International Honor Society for Students in Two-Year Colleges, are recognized by the Phi Theta Kappa emblem below their photo. Those graduating with a cumulative grade point average of 3.5 or above are also recognized. It is now my pleasure to award the certificates and degrees. At this point, I normally ask the graduates to all stand. So graduates at home, if you would choose to do so, please stand. With the authority vested in me as the president of Southwestern Community College by the Board of Trustees, and in accordance with the statutes of the state of Iowa, I confer all degrees and diplomas as certified by our faculty and staff. To the family and friends of the graduates who are watching tonight, I hope when the photo of your special graduate is shown that you will cheer loudly just as you would if you were in the gymnasium tonight. Congratulations, graduates. Associate of Arts degrees. Megan Maxine Allen. Aaron T. Alsop. Robert J. Aquino Lorencio. Brielle May Baker. Skaya Bannister. Thomas James Bates. Nelly R. Beeman. Eden Evans Phillips Campbell. William Colin Bodell. Devin R. Bowen. Shandy Brown. Devin Joe Bowles. Angela C. Butcher. Taylor Jean Buxton. Cynthia K. Carlo. Tony Sebahar. Stella Chabet. Bethany Christensen. Jada Louise Clausen. Misty May Claybaker. Taylor C. Clendenin. Ethan John Coleman. Quincy W. Collier. Cassidy Conley. Karema Corona Alvarez. Danielle Sarah Costain. Yasmine Janelia Cribb. Gerlin Ariel Cruz Perez. 
Ashland Cutting. Hannah Jo Darlin. Alan M. Davis. Evan W. Davis. Natasha L. Davis. Emily Donner. Andrea Echeverria. Jacob Elliott. Hannah Elwood. Bryce Logan Fitzgerald. Tucker Wayne Flynn. Angela M. Gardner. Rhea May Kippel. Angel Kathleen Giroux. Brooke Gordon. Haley Ann Gowdy. Stormy N. Graham. Sadie J. Green. Samantha Marie Hagedorn. Julia Hansen. Zadie Zacadia Hatfield. Landy Marie Helgevold. Brooke Nicole Henrik. Cole M. Higgins. Brianna Noel Hoffman. Maslin Riley Hummel. Giovanni R. Islas. Lucian Marie Israel. Skyler Johnson. Simone Jordan. Amber Carney. Angela Marie Cruz. Kirsten Michelle Latham. Cameron Ann Lockery. Shariah Aliyah Lawrence. Troy Lewis. Cassidy Ray Lohman. Mariah K. Lombard Shipley. Ryan Elizabeth Martin. Dylan M. McAlexander. Clarissa A. McElroy. Brenda Lee McIntosh. Marie K. McNett. Trevor James Meisenheimer. Abigail Miller. Chase Andrew Miner. Andrea Marie Morland. Jessica L. Muller. Jalen Kyrie Nicholson Bourne. Jake J. Ponich. Adrio Antoja Batista. Jennifer Parsons. Hannah Elise Perez. Shannon Perkins. Haley Pollard. Hannah Pollard. Margaret Pugh. Taylor Lynn Purdy. Lindsay 
Raider. Emma Roan. Riley Rohrer. Brianna Marie Ross. Ashley Rothy. Ella Rutherford. Caitlin Daly Ann Shad. Andrew John Seals. Riley Shannon. Aaron H. Silzer. McKenna Danielle Scroll. Mackenzie R. Slykus. Beth Smith. Holly Nicole Smith. Matthew Smith. Levi Bernard Snyder. Nicole Spar. Elizabeth Lexine Starlin. Colton Stevens. Micah K. Stevens. Michaela Stahl. Sean R. Swanson. Eric Donald Sausbielen. Austin M. Taylor. Kelsey Jean Tibbs. Leslie Maribel Torres. Cassiana R. Trimble. Parker Van Pelt. Cody Wagner. Cami Walters. Sierra Willits. Kayla Willis. Akeen J. Woods. Blair Nicole Workman. Sebastian Anthony Zender. Candidates for the Associate of Science degree. Caitlin Diane Belding. Royce Irving John Bernard. Ethan John Coleman. Ariel M. Cookenham. William Courtney. Luis Alfonso Diaz Torres. Samantha Marie Hagedorn. Kendra Kirkland. Zoe Ann Lacey. Elena Rose Link. Trevor James Meisenheimer. Jaden L. Miller. Chase Andrew Minor. Hannah Elise Perez. Dawn Helene Pullen. Sage Nicole Rice. Micah J. Ricks. Robert S. Rodriguez. Ella Rutherford. Tori Dawn Smith. Brian D. Soto. Jenny Cleone Stamper. 
Danica P. Sunderman. Jesse Dalen Victor. Candidates for a degree, Associate of Applied Arts in Professional Music. Natalie Ruth Block. Nicholas March Capanieri. Charisma M. Carson. Casey J. Domer. Isabel Jordison. Amanda Jane Ross. Hannah Marie Thompson. Candidates for Associate of Applied Science and Accounting. Haley Cox. Ashley Haycock. Shannon Johnson. Casey Dawn Quick. Associate of Applied Science, Accounting and Information Technology. Chelsea Lynn Curran. Associate of Applied Science, Administrative Office Technology. Barbara Sampson. Associate of Applied Science, Agricultural Business. Casey K. Allen. Emily Marlene Ford. Travis Paul Masher. Barbara Jean P. Dina Snyder. Steph Steinball. Mitchell Swank. Kessler Allen Thomas. Rebecca Ann Williamson. The Associate of Applied Science in Automotive Repair Technology. Evan M. Cockerham. Noah Denny. Brett E. Gorham. Brody Granfield. Andrew Reball. Dylan McDonald. Devin Meek. Dennis M. Parks. Weston E. Rognus. Evan Skelton. Candidates for Associate of Applied Science in Business Administration. Netta Marissa Boyer. Corey E. Copeland. Haley Cox. Cindy M. Cregeen. Gabrielle Lynn Hoag. Shannon Johnson. Christina Mitchell. Jeanette J. Morrill. Carmen Sierra Pickens. Lana Ray. Spencer Allen Thompson. Candidates for Associate of Applied Science in Crop Production. Troy Arnold. Kyle P. Durnham. Cole Hunter Swenson. Candidates for Associate of Applied Science in Electrical Technology. Colton Michael Abel. Bryce Allen Alford. 
Joshua Karstens. Sean D. Lott. Austin Lee Lundy. Gary Stevens. Connor M. Thibodeau. Associate of Applied Science and Graphic Design. Allie Sue Enright. Nicholas J. Holsty. Peyton Cheyenne Jellison. Brendan Kyle Langloss. Kian M. Williamson. The Associate of Applied Science in Industrial Technology. Gustavo Herrera. Christopher Douglas Hildreth. Jeffrey Mador. Lorenz Mora. Scott Pendegraff. Nathaniel Reif. Michael John Tyler. Caleb Augustus Fairlinden. Cade J. Vicker. Candidates for Associate of Applied Science in Information Technology Systems Networking. Lane Cobb. Dwayne R. Feldhacker. Mark Lester Fernandez. Kristen A. Hagen. Brandon Heitzig. Christy S. Kingery. Paul P. Lorenz III. Benjamin Thomas Mullen. Kylie Petticourt. Levi D. Wilson. Associate of Applied Science in Livestock Production. Kayla A. Abel. Shelby Ann Mathis. Mariah Rose Murphy. Dina Snyder. Candidates for the Associate of Applied Science in Registered Nursing. Audrey Lynn Baharud. Shelby Belt. Melissa Lynn Bond. High Case Rebecca Chalky. Abigail Marie Anelia Collado. Sophia Boxette Collado. Josie L. Cook. Shasta Joe Copper. McKenna Fitzgerald. Brittany Grace Ford. Shelley J. Fox. Patricia I. Frank. Jocelyn S. Frost. Tiffany L. Gibbons. Connor Henderson. Gary Lee Ills II. Mindy Jones. Baya Veronica Kane. 
Sarah Kernan. Amanda Klobnock. Cassidy Lynn Klumhaus. Catherine E. Konsitsky. Chelsea Koonan. Victoria M. Langill. Paige Ann McElfish. Sydney Marie McElfish. Elsie Evania Mokombe Woleta. Susan W. Mungai. Yesenia Nelson. Madison Lynn Newton. Jawei Gamelu. Quinu Binbi Guma. Jonna F. Palmer. Tiffany Ann Paulson. Stacy A. Potter. Emily Marie Powell. Tabitha Rono. Shelby Lynn Taylor. Becky Utley. Rachel K. Vanderfloot. Candidates for a degree in Associate of Applied Science Welding Technology. Viene Montiel. Keaton Pearson. Candidates for diplomas in Auto Collision Repair Refinish. Wyatt Monahan. Artemio Sanchez. Sergio Sandoval. Tavares Thompson. Diploma for Auto Repair Technology. Blake D. Alden. Evan M. Cockerham. Noah Denny. Brody Granfield. Dylan Holsky. Andrew G. Rebal. Courtney Nielsen. Weston E. Rognes. Evan Skelton. Trey Anthony Whipple. The Diploma for Carpentry and Building Trades. Benjamin J. Barrett. Jade L. Conley. Quentin A. Gregg. Daniel A. Kenyon. Morgan J. Pierce. Colton J. Richardson. Cal W. Spidel. Diploma for Electrical Technology. Brandon R. Ditber. James Robert Graham. Jordan I. Montiel. Edwin Moreno. Shane K. Scott. Gary Stevens. Carter H. Still. Cade A. Tharp. 
Diploma for Industrial Technology. Michael P. Bockhoven. Dalton S. Karstens. Brent A. Miller. Stephen L. Provost. The Diploma for Information Technology Systems Networking. Jason W. Brokaw. Joshua R. Brown. Brianne N. Bird. Christopher John Claybaker. Blaine R. Cobb. Iambi Alo Seraphine. Paul P. Lorenz III. Chase P. Lorenz. Thomas D. Rankin. Levi D. Wilson. Diploma in Office Skills. Corey E. Copeland. Samantha Trummer. Diploma for Practical Nursing Education. Laura Atkinson. Christine Ann Albers. Faith Berry. Callan Bond. Caitlin M. Bowie. Haley Bussey. Courtney Clark. Victoria L. Donham. Mackenzie Erlewine. Alexis Evans. Desiree Ford. Claudia Garcia. Cameo J. Gherkin. Chantel Gonzalez Love. Kendall J. Hardy. Zakia Leandria Hart. Elizabeth Josephine Hauser. Kate Heyer. Mary Kathleen Hokuson. Jamie L. Holmes. Maya Hutchison. Holly J. Jacobson. Shannon Marie Jefferson. Mariel K. Jones. Alexis Larkin. Kareen Bonwai. Emma E. Mobley. Rihanna Moreland. Jordan Moreland. Dana Lenore Morris. Kayla Plyman. Taylor Lynn Purdy. Trina Ray. Donye Rosales Landeros. Christopher Savagio. 
Tia Shaw. Jaden Stevens. Danica P. Sunderman. Cheyenne Lynn Sunderman. Katie Jo Taylor. Britta Tracy. Cody Walker. Marissa Dawn Walter. Hannah Leanne Washburn. Taylor Nicole Wasman. Sydney Weiss Sorensen. Shelby West. Tracy Ann Wood. Megan Woods. Diploma in Welding Technology. Grant J. Gehring. Logan S. Lawson. James Patrick McDonald. Corey James Nevitt. Laura Sue Radford. Carson Allen Thompson. Congratulations to all of our graduates. As we close our commencement ceremonies tonight, I would be remiss if I didn't thank the following people and groups. First, thank you to Bing Bang and to Terry Higgins, Joel Wires, and Scott Vicker in our marketing department for quickly putting together this amazing virtual graduation ceremony. Second, thank you to our entire staff for adjusting to new work environments, new tasks, and coming together as a team to provide the best student experience possible this semester. Next, a huge thank you to all of our faculty, and especially those who transition courses to an online format in the blink of an eye. You are all superheroes in my book. Thank you to the family and friends who have supported these students throughout their education, and especially this semester. You have been an essential piece to each graduate's success, and I hope you are all together at home cheering and celebrating tonight. Finally, I would like to thank and wish all the best to our graduates. Thank you again for choosing Southwestern Community College and being a part of our family. Thank you for your patience and grace this semester as we navigated new norms. We are excited to see where your futures take you and the accomplishments that are to come. Please stay connected and let us know how you are doing. Ladies and gentlemen, the class of 2020.